What was it? What was your the song that catapulted everything? That was probably the first like like they I got some radio play for my first album, which is like the first songs I ever wrote. So um a lot for a long time I was I guess I still <laughs> cringe when I listen to a lot of that music, which is now like decades old. <laughs> It's like having your the first things you ever made like out publicly in the world forever. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, Crazy Love was probably the first one that kind of like was a a thing. What about original? Um, I don't know. Like, well, One Foot on Sand was um, a special song for me and kind of cool because I made that album. I was living in LA at the time and put it out and didn't really get much um, airplay or anything. And it wasn't until like a couple years later, a lot of times it has felt like I'm <laughs> making, making things for myself because mm -hmm. you put it out and you don't seem to get much coming back from it. And I came back and played a show in Kona and one of my um, good friends, Jason, who's now in the new band that I'm in was like, Hey man, your one foot on sand song was like me and all the boys. You know, we lost um, a couple of brothers, and we all learned it and sang it at the at their memorial, and it's super special to us. Mm. And I was like, oh wow, like had no idea. And then I would get more and more people coming up to me and going like, oh, this is our graduation song, or it really helped me when I moved away. And so that was like um, that one's really special, mm. and that, that's that's one that I wrote and um, didn't even think it was landing anywhere <laughs> until a couple of years afterwards. Yeah, well, yeah. you didn't know. One foot was always in the sand the whole time. <laughs> yeah, the, like I said on their call, the, the Hawaii National Anthem. <laughs> Besides Hawaii Fono I think for any kid that goes away, they always listen to that. Well, I love it. And like, <laughs> I, I mean, I knew I was in a unique position to be making music um, for here, but living away. So I was like, well, that's one um, perspective that I can share that I have that's mm -hmm. that's different than a lot of the artists that are here mm -hmm. um, and like a lot of them like you know when I play this song um, like on the continent or whatever I'm like you're my people because like you know like we have a shared experience of like leaving a place that we love and having um, aspirations for other things and still feeling connected to home in a way 